Hello everyone, in today's video we're going to be covering how to get the gold camo for the snipers and the marksman's rifles in Modern Warfare. So what I'm going to be doing in this video for you guys is showing you some gameplay of me doing some of the challenges, showing you the camo skins, and kind of some tips and tricks to kind of help speed up the process to make your life a bit easier to get that gold camo as fast as possible, because everyone wants that awesome gold camo. It looks super nice. Alright, before we get into the video guys, if you do watch this video and you find it helpful in some way and you enjoy the content, please make sure to leave a like and also subscribe if you want to see some more Modern Warfare tips and tricks from me. I'll be releasing some more videos for you guys in the near future. Alright guys, let's get into the video. Alright, so in order to unlock the gold camo for your marksman's rifle or sniper rifle, you'll firstly need to reach the weapon's max level and reaching the max level will unlock the 10 camo categories so once you complete all 10 of those challenges for those camos, then you'll unlock your gold camo skin. So the marksman's rifles and the sniper rifles both have the exact same 10 challenges you need to complete. The only difference is each weapon will have a different max level. So the challenges you'll need to complete as you're leveling up your weapon is spray paint with 450 kills, woodland with 60 headshots, digital with 50 kills while crouching, dragon for 50 one-shot kills, splinter with kills with all attachments on the weapon, Topo with 50 long shots, Tiger with 50 mounted kills, Stripes with 25 double kills, Reptile with 75 kills with no attachments on the weapon, and Skulls with 25 kills without dying, so 25 kills on a kill streak. So my first tip for you guys would be as you're leveling up your weapon, make sure that you're focusing on the challenges. Don't just level up your weapon to max level and then start the challenges. I reckon it's best to chip away at the challenges while you've unlocked them and just kind of keep working on them to kind of keep on top of them but do keep in mind if you do max up your level higher you can do multiple challenges at the same time so you can do a double kill headshot while crouching so like that could be a strategy as well um, I was doing that towards the end I was like sliding into kills um, you might see some of this in this gameplay I've got for you but I kind of do it a lot but that is also something that can help as well Another tip I got for you guys is the game mode. So I was playing a lot of Domination and Ground War. So I found those the best to kind of track enemies. So you know, you've got an objective, so you can kind of go, all right, I need to get this mount to kill. I can mount up on this ledge, look over the point. When people come over there, I can get that kill. So it's if it's team deathmatch, it's kind of a bit harder to wait around in a corner um, and to do mount, like mount to kills is probably the, the most hardest one I'd say out of all. They're not that hard, it's just time consuming. So trying to get the mounted kills and the double kills were my main focus. I found domination was good for mounted kills and also double kills and ground war was good for long shots and pretty much everything else that was in the camo category. So play what you like playing but I found those the most helpful. As for gun attachments, there isn't really much advice. Um, Pretty much just set up what you're comfortable with. You can open up a private match and just test out different attachments so once you get higher level you can kind of see what you'd like to use. Um, I know when I got the gold AK um, I did a few different setups for like long shots and um, double kills and stuff like that depending on mobility but as for like, your marksman's rifles and sniper rifles as you can see I'm getting a few long shots here and I'm using just a you know, an iron sight. I don't really like using full scopes on snipers. I know it's kind of weird, but it's what I like playing. So just play what you're comfortable with and what you like playing with, and you'll get there. Just chip away at it, and you'll get that gold in no time. All right, hopefully you guys found that video helpful. If you did, be sure to leave a like. And if you're brand new around here, consider subscribing and uh, for more content like this, more gaming tips and tricks. Alright guys, I hope you have a nice night, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.